Your girl is a Taurus sun. Focus on your peace, moving forward. If it shows up half-baked, half-cooked, half-made, half-ready, release it. Period. Stop forcing shit that's no one. Ain't gonna hold nobody. Ain't gonna fake shit, ain't gonna hold shit, ain't gonna make shit up. I love what I do. Cause I'm tap the fuck in. I'ma read this motherfucking course yeah. left, right, up, down, sideways, sideways. Tap the fuck in. You hear me? Yeah, I read Mirror it. two. Tap the fuck Backwards in. In reverse. Yeah. I'ma read these bitches. Hello, Sagittarius. Welcome. Let's get into your messages. This will be for Sagittarius. Any placement. Flip and switch the energy. Take what resonates only from the multiple scenarios that will come out in this collective Sagittarius reading. Anything you need to know about me will be down below. Just click that link of uh, my social media links and my link to book a reading will be in a title. Let's see what does the universe wants you to know. We got Aquarius energy with the star and the two of cups cancer energy in the eight of swords. Someone could feel stuck in a relationship. They could be juggling you going back and forth. You could be tired of relationships not going well. You could have sabotaging tendencies. You could be the reason they don't go well. In multiple scenarios, if this reading does not resonate, it's not your story. You could be in the spotlight. You could be a star on your way to fame and fortune. You could be a healer as well, humanitarian. Let's see, for Sagittarius, any place. And if someone could want a healer connection with you, you could have been inspired by someone. A certain partner, a certain soulmate, two of cups. Fool, starting over, starting fresh, packing lightly. You could be moving. You may not have much. Aquarius energy, heavy Aquarius. Hmm. There could be a masculine king of cups ready to get his life in order, ready to start fresh. He could be moving out of a home, fresh out of jail, fresh out the hospital, fresh out the psych ward. Okay. Wherever. He fresh somewhere. Fresh on the scene. And starting a new business. Taking a different route to something you're already seasoned in. Let's see. For Sagittarius. We will clarify. I will clarify. For you guys. For Sagittarius, any placement. Flipping over, we got the Three of Cups. Friendship circle. New friendship group. Like-minded individuals. You're, you're finding your, your people, your soul tribe. People that are like you. You're hoping to connect with more people. Network. Some of you have moved, moved to a new town. Some of you, you're a teenager, is ready to make new friends. That's new. I hardly get stuff about kids. There's a teenager here that needs to make more friends. Or maybe you need to check his friendship circle. Let's see. His? I said his. Let's see. Could be a girl, though. These chicks here, they look like they gossiping and all of that. Check your teenager's friends. Four Sagittarius. Multiple scenarios. Six of Cups. Definitely youthful energy. Childhood. Uh, Again, I'm going to repeat. Look into your kids' friendships. For somebody. Okay. Or your own. Especially if you've known them a while. Now I got the fool with the three of cups and the six of cups. There could be someone that wants to start over and reconcile. They miss you. Or this is you missing someone from your past. Or you're yearning for a partnership. Something new. Some of you are yearning for polygamy. I said it. Three of cups. Three is a crowd. Three women here. You won't release this one person, but you're, you're wanting something new. Yep. What else with Sagittarius? Or oh, this is somebody you're dealing with. They are a poly person. Polygamy or poly, polyamory? Polyamory? Polyamory. Polyamory. Thank you, spirit. <laughs> I say amory. Lovers. I'm telling you, this is about a partnership. Someone's ready to link up and get with somebody. Someone's ready for a partner. They may get in their own way or there's some kind of conflict around this empress, the person they would rather be with. Someone could have broke two people up spiritually or someone needs to heal because they just ruined a relationship with an empress. Taurus and Libra energy, Aquarius with their father. So Gemini with the lovers. Someone could have a choice between two or this is you. You could be someone's choice. Eh, eh, eh. three of cups could be a third party or you may have a choice to make unbeknownst to you you may be someone's choice and not even know it that's unbeknownst to you let's see though for Sagittarius somebody craving sex I'm not playing somebody is ready to let's get it on the lovers 
that's lust that's union that's partnership but it's lust as well someone could be they gotta watch the g word someone could be same sex flaker inconsistent they don't know what they want and you don't know what you want you go back and forth about it more than likely with a particular person or in general someone's bisexual they want both they want to they want both genders that's the wishy-washy energy at the same time though and whoever you're with they're not with that they're not poly because that's what it would be absolutely <laughs> damn what's the fool who my readers today libra had me going off scorpio had me entertained and y'all got me curious maybe somebody by curious what's the fool spontaneous somebody's ready for something new somebody tried to get in the way of a connection with this conspiracy other people plotting to keep you apart or something it's like someone didn't want to sneak around they don't want to hear no gospel about their connection conspiracy it was a down low relationship rather it be same sex or someone want to keep their relationship private hi big up i got spontaneous headed towards you with the fool someone's ready to take a leap of faith and just try it. just do it like nike uh what's this song walking on the moon shit somebody about to do something that's solid someone's ready to try something new they could be trisexual let me i mean nah for real somebody yeah okay so yeah someone's coming towards you for a brand new beginning someone could be putting themselves back out there they just say fuck it let's do it could be dating online he got a phone in his hand he got his hand in his pocket like he's like Ugh, let me just see he could be big guarded this could be you if you're masculine i'm watching mm -hmm. it's definitely giving somebody wants to start over or spontaneous fool take a leap of faith there's a third party situation someone wants to invite someone in let's do something spontaneous let's try it fool and whoever on the other side of it they not with it they might try it though because this other person came in the mix on purpose whoever the person is being brought in on this third party dynamic this threesome that's exactly what this is let me just say it it's a threesome somebody wants a threesome the other person did some kind of manipulation tactics let's just say that that can be as broad as spell work or as low-key as in the dm or on the on the line what's this three of cups kind of sort of sideways y'all see that before i touch it it's, it's it's almost to the right as far as coming in i'm gonna flip it over i want to see but as far as something that can come into fruition not quite i feel like i don't even <laughs> i want to say this before i flip it over i feel like someone is trying to get something going whether it be this threesome starting over reconciling with you or they're cheating and you don't know it or they cheated on you. This could be past energy. Or they're trying to sneak around and deal with someone's person. Like an ex or something. You know what? This is what this is giving. Mixed signal. I'm telling you. I want to flip this card over so bad. But hold on. I don't know what it's saying. It's like there's a friendship circle. The three of cups is inner circle. Friends. But someone's trying to do something sneaky within a friendship group. layers multiple factors it's deep <laughs> it's deep it's multiple things to look at somebody could be married or oh, this is symbolic for it's 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 deeper than that wow so i got a pisces on my tv janae aika she said pussy fairy on the way child listen this is a whole lot of sex tonight Pick it back up. Pick up from how things were left mixed signals. They don't know if they want to start over with you or not. Reconcile or not. They not even fully divorced for some of you. 
or they newly divorced they ain't over it yet or that person keeps trying to get back with them text them flirt with them six of cups has passed missing someone also well they got history together it ain't over with not completely for some of you rather emotionally whether emotionally whether or not it's emotional or uh that person is physically in their life and i do mean physically all right well what else is this some of you, you in a third part of relationship and they're not fully divorced. For some of you, you want marriage with somebody that's also dealing with somebody else. Or you're dealing with someone else, yet you've proposed to someone. For some of you, in this friendship circle, the person they want to date, dated their friend. Ooh. Six of cups. This is ooh, 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 six of cups. Zen reorganizing priorities. Somebody, you know, somebody like you know, I gotta get my shit together. I got too much shit to sort through in my whole goddamn life. Someone's focusing more on their children or their child. They're reorganizing their priorities. Gamble about to take a risk to see you, but for some of you, you're you're the new priority that they want to reorganize. Like. If they played on you, then talk to you as much as they should have, didn't date you, didn't open up, they're shifting that. They miss you. They just gonna roll the dice and take it, shoot their shot. Well, this is you. You like, you know what? I like this person. Let me prioritize them. I feel something. It's a soul connection. Six of Cups with the lovers. It's absolutely a soulmate. For sure. Now that tw that twin flame energy could be in a lovers with the Adam and Eve thing. Sharing of essence. I ain't trying to get that deep. Uh, but yeah, mm -hmm. what's the priority? Let's see. What's that? Let's see. I'm about to be nosy. I was just gonna ask, what's one of the factors? And it fell right over there. I'm clarifying what's the priorities, and I also was gonna ask, what's one of the factors? My team knew I was gonna ask, I'm testing the water, seeing how far they can push you reorganizing priorities is what i wanted to clarify but it fell over here on multiple factors so they one of the factors is you lack boundaries or they wanted to see what you were willing to tolerate and for some of you you wouldn't go on with it so they're like okay let me let me shift things since you're not fucking with this that was one of the factors it was the third party it's still a third party for some of you flaky inconsistent let me shift things since you're not fucking with this for some of you, you're the problem. Yeah. You weren't sure what you wanted. At that time or currently. Trey Songs is a Sagittarius. It says back home. Featuring Summer Walker, which is an Aries. And he said, if it is in love, why does it same? It's a throwback. Why do I keep coming back home? This is some of you. This is a twin. They trying to figure out how the fuck they feel. If it's not a twin, it's some, six of cups. For some of you, it's somebody from your past or it's somebody you feel a soul connection to. You can't quite figure out what you want. Or you've been with this person forever, but you start not to feel stuff for them. So you're trying to figure out, do I want this or do I want to add somebody to the mix? Or do I want to keep cheating because I don't want to leave what I've known for so long? However it goes. For some of you, you're not over your past or they're not over their past. So it's hard to start fresh, start over, and let someone new in. Spontaneous, starting fresh, zero with the fool. It's a collective read. I gotta get in it. In the nitty gritty. <laughs> Multiple scenarios. What's the lovers as a hidden factor at the bottom of the deck? Two cars, nervous and recent. I'm telling you, this motherfucker wasn't going nowhere to begin with. Her they come right back around, randomly popping up on you. Okay, or well, this is you resurfacing random person or situation, and they nervous. Clarifying the lovers. It's a soulmate or a twin flame or somebody you thought you didn't want. 
Hurry, come back around. Somebody you thought you was over with, hurry, come back around. Somebody you tried to kick out of your energy, hurry, come the emotions and the feelings right back around. Or this them about you. They tried to move on, but they can't because it's a soul motherfucking connection. So my advice is boundaries, the big B. Whatever the fuck they got going on that you're not feeling, don't go for it. I don't care. Do not create conflict that do not need to be created but some of you there was some kind of hostility that broke y'all up in the first place what's another good advice for y'all shit mm, some of you need to shoot your shot because whatever you scared nervous to shoot for it ain't even currently happening it didn't already happen for some of you, you need to not hold on to a relationship situation or the memory of a relationship that didn't work out so that you can move forward if you don't like it. If you don't like where it was, where it stood. If you don't like where you currently are being single and unavailable and miserable. Because you won't let nobody in. Your trust is fucked up. That's not fair to you or any any version of you that want to try again. But some of your spirit guides, friends, and ancestors, family, ride or die crew is bringing you and a lost lover back together. 